So we have past paper, question number 18 here, and we need to solve x squared plus 7x minus 11 is equal to zero. We need to give our solutions as decimals. Now this is a two mark question, and sometimes you can factorize quadratics, but I have a feeling we're not gonna be able to do this, or at least very easily, because we're gonna be having decimals as our answers. So another way to find the solutions to this quadratic equation is using the quadratic formula. So the quadratic formula will give you the two solutions to this equation, and it is x is equal to minus b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4a c all over 2a and this can be used where ax squared plus bx plus c is equal to zero in this case we just have a is equal to one because we just have x squared by itself b is equal to seven because we have seven x and c is equal to minus 11 because we just have minus 11 there by itself and this is obviously all equal to zero so all we have to do is sub these values into the quadratic formula we're going to get x is equal to minus seven plus or minus the square root of seven squared minus four times one times minus 11 all over two times one so our two solutions are going to be x is equal to minus seven plus plus or minus the square root of 93 over two. Now let's go through one at a time and then give our answers as decimals, just like they asked in the question. So X is gonna be equal to minus seven plus the square root of 93 over two. That's our first answer. And as a decimal to two decimal places, that's gonna be 1.32. Then the next one will be X is equal to minus seven minus square root of 93 over two. To two decimal places, that's gonna be minus 8.32. So hopefully that made sense. If you do have any questions or queries, you know, just leave them down below and I'll do my best to get back to you. Best luck with your maths and Thanks for watching the video.